Now, your KSBW weather forecast with meteorologist Art Jarrett. Good morning to you. Let's take a peek at what we have going on here with temperatures widespread through the 50s with a tropical component now moving in with some warmer air today. And you can see it just offshore. There's a little bit of a cloud cover here building up this nice little 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 band of cloud cover that's uh, bringing in some rainfall into uh, the Bay Area. We had a few sprinkles for the Santa Cruz Mountains early. You can see right here it's back again down to the Monterey Peninsula now. And as that little line continues to drive over the local mountains, it's going to wring out a little bit of moisture. You can see how it's a little bit heavier to our north. So we'll have scattered showers Day. After this uh, rainfall in this morning, we'll see 60s, some 70s mixed in across the state. 81 in Palm Springs, getting to 60 in Redding, 51 in Lake Tahoe if you're headed that direction. Still a bit slushy, though, for uh, any type of snow above 700 feet. We get into the rainfall, as I've shown you already. We'll see it kind of slip down a little bit more so into the Santa Cruz Mountains and Monterey Peninsula, and that's for the afternoon hours today. And then eventually we'll see it kind of back off a bit and then start to reappear again as we get into the evening hours, the late evening hours over the Monterey Peninsula, Salinas. Hollister as well slipping down again. We're going to see some of this moisture bubbling up right down into San Benito County, the Salinas Valley, the Pinnacles, the Diablo Range, as well as the Gablin Range and up in the Santa Cruz Mountains in Bay Area. We'll see more of the same for Saturday in the wee hours of the morning before sunrise. We'll see continued showers working through the area all the way into at least the uh, noon hour and then up and out. We get some clearing in with colder air starting to funnel in and that'll help to clear skies a little bit more for Sunday. We're not expecting much over the next uh, 24 hours, just under two tenths of an inch. And then by the time we get into Saturday, We'll add a little bit to that as well, going dry for Sunday. And then this is what I have for you today. We have some shower activity as we go into today as, as well, but take a look. We go a little bit farther in the future. Sunday afternoon and evening, we increase the clouds with chances of rainfall coming in for Monday. That'll continue with a big storm working in. You can see that. Boy, I can't, in fact, it's targeted up to by Humboldt, working back down to the Bay Area. And then for us as well, as we go into uh, Monday night into Tuesday, that lasts all the way through Tuesday afternoon. And then high pressure builds back in a mild round of high pressure which will dry us out for possibly Wednesday afternoon. So today, 60 to 73 degrees, cloudy and humid. We'll get into winds up to 5 to 20 miles per hour with 60s widespread today, getting into some 70s from the beaches down to the mountains and into the valleys. We see 72 for King City, 68 for Carmel Valley. Then tonight, 46 to 56 degrees, slight chance of showers for you, cool to mild temperatures. In your KSBW eight-day forecast, we're going to have temperatures a little bit cooler tomorrow with mostly cloudy conditions, chance of rainfall, and we dry out Sunday and rain comes back on Monday. Britt, Lauren.